Hi, I'm Yujielu. Today, I'm going to talk about our work on future well diverse chains framework for recommendation. This is a collaborative project done by Tencent and Zhejiang University. Recommender systems assume a central part of many real-world applications with prevalence of the internet and information technology. On online platforms, users interact with a series of items in a chronological order, implying continuous and temporary correlation between each item. In this scenario, the sequential recommenders have become indispensable techniques in the recommendation area, which aim at predicting the next item that the user may interact with by modeling users' preferences on the basis of sequential dependencies among users' interactions. In recommender systems, modeling user item behaviors is essential for user representation learning. Existing sequential recommendation algorithms model and represent user preferences in various manners. Most conventional models such as Markov chain-based and factorization-based ones have successfully captured users' short-term and long-term interests by adopting Markov chains and matrix factorization respectively. But either failed to model intricate dynamics or ignore the time dependency. More recent works propose to encode users' historical behaviors into users' varying interests by leveraging capsule routine mechanism. Nevertheless, all of these methods model user preferences, only taking into account the past behaviors of users, ignoring the potential future preference and failing to capture the time-involving chance of user-diversified preferences. We argue that preferences change over time of similar users is an actually important factor to model user preferences. Such chains can be summarized from the relative future behaviors of users with similar interests. Specifically, for an inspected user, other users with similar interests chance to have common behaviors with the inspected user and the behaviors that happen after the common behavior can be viewed as the relative future behaviors. We also argue that representing user neighbors by one representation vector can be a bottleneck for capturing diverse neighbors of users because we have to compress all information related with diverse neighbors of users into one representation vector. Thus, all information about diverse neighbors of users is fused together causing inaccurate neighbor retrieval and then the inaccurate item retrieval for the matching stage. Instead, we adopt multiple representation vectors to express distinct neighbors of users separately. By this way, diverse neighbors of users are considered separately in the matching stage, enabling more accurate neighbor retrieval as well as the item retrieval for every aspect of reasons. Here is an overview and objective function of our framework. The left part of that illustrates the nectar work of our base model. The base model takes user historical behaviors as inputs and outputs user preference representation vectors for prediction decoder. The right part of that consists of an implicit neighbor behavior extractor, a sequence modeling module same as the left part which outputs relative future preference. A diverse chains capture layer and a time-aware attention layer is then used to compute the final future preference for the user. To capture time-varying preferences of users, we then apply recurrent neural network to model the variable length sequence data to compute the user embeddings. Particularly, we use long short-term memory cell as the basic RNN unit, which captures temporal dynamics. To capture the dynamics of interaction sequences, we apply RNN to compute embeddings for users. The input of our sequence modeling module is the user historical behavior sequence or the relative future behavior sequence from the extracted neighbors, which contains a list of item IDs representing the user's interactions with items in time order. We utilize clustering process to group neighbors extracted via previous multi-hop filter 
into several clusters. Neighbors from one cluster are expected to be closely related and collectively represent one particular aspect of user behaviors. Here, we designed the multi-neighbor extractor layer for clustering historical behaviors and inferring representation vectors for resulted clusters. The objective of the multi-neighbor extractor layer is to learn representations for expressing properties of user behaviors as well as whether corresponding behaviors exist. The semantic connection between capsules and neighbor representations motivates us to regard the neighbor representations as neighbor capsules and employ dynamic routine to learn chance capsules from neighbor capsules. Then, we utilize the time of real attention to activate the weights of diverse chains to capture the timeliness of each chain. After computing the chain embeddings from activated chains through a time of well attention layer, we concatenate it with the user historical behavior embedding to form a user preference embedding. Then, we can predict the possibility of the user interacting with the item. Please refer to the paper for the detail of our architecture. We conduct an extensive experiments and in-depth analysis to verify the performance of FAT for recommendation. We use the three large benchmark datasets. The statistics of the three datasets are shown in this table. In each dataset, we partition users' interactions into chaining, validation, and test sets to avoid data sparsity. We filter out the users and items with only few interactions in our experiment. To evaluate, we randomly select an interacted item by the user as target item for each user, while the items interacted before the target item are collected as the user behaviors. The model performance for the sequential recommendation is shown in this table. We run experiments to dissect the effectiveness of our recommendation model. We compare the performance of that with a baseline model of that and four state-of-the-art models. All these models are running on three datasets introduced above, such as Amazon Books, Steam, and MovieLens. According to the results shown in table, our model felt to obtain better performance on all evaluation metrics of all the tasks than other models. This table reports the performance of our model felt in different parameter settings by changing number of trends. We list the performance results from our model for the three datasets with different parameter settings. And this table compares the result of setting target item from the first to last item, the third to last item, and the fifth to last one. The largest improvements appear on increasing k from 1 to 3. This demonstrates that by adding the number of target items, our model can capture more chain information and be more powerful to predict future sequences. From this table, you can see the recommend diversity performance of baseline models and our models on the three datasets. You can see that the quantitative and qualitative results from relative extensive experiments on real-world datasets demonstrate the proposed framework not only outperforms the state-of-the-art sequential recommendation methods across various metrics, but also makes complementary and fresh recommendations. In conclusion, we propose a novel feature of well diverse chain framework to capture diverse chains of user preference dynamically. Our framework leverages a neighbor behavior extractor to generate relative future interactions from similar users implicitly and utilize diverse chains module to capture intrinsic varying dynamics of user preferences to improve the expressive ability of chained representation we utilize 
turn a well attention layer to make the duration between prediction time and target item interaction time to choose which trend is more relative. Experimental results demonstrate that our models can achieve significant improvements over state-of-the-art models on three challenging datasets. Thank you for watching.